Hi there! Today we're going to learn how to use R to create a box plot and within that box plot to change the title name, to give it a subtitle, and to change the axis labels. So in order to do that, you're going to need the ggplot package. You're going to need to install that and then load the ggplot2 library right after that. We are going to skip this step because we already have ggplot. So once you have it, you go ahead and enter, you load that library. And let's call up our data set that we're going to use for a little box plot. We have warp breaks. So these are data on the number of breaks by wool type and tension. All right, let's go ahead and create a box plot. And I'm going to show you the syntax for that in R in just a moment. Here it is. So we're going to call it boxplot.wool. We're going to use ggplot. We're going to put x. Uh, make the x-axis wool, the y-axis the number of breaks, and let's go ahead and make that fire brick as a color and just push enter. And soon you're going to see the graphic pop up over here, see what that looks like as soon as we issue the command to bring up the object. So there it is. All right. Looks pretty good, but let's say that we want to add a title up here. Let's say that we want to call it something and we want to have a subtitle, right? Maybe we want breaks to be capitalized. Maybe we want wool to be capitalized. What should we do? Well, here's the command structure for that. We're going to go ahead and start by just repeating the name of the object of the graph that we saved, which is boxplot.wool. Then we're going to use this little plus symbol here. We're going to add. And what are we going to add? We're going to use the labs command for label. And within that, we're in the, within the parentheses, as you can see, we can give it a title. We can give it a subtitle. And we can go ahead and rename the y and x axes to what we want. And once that's done, we're going to see what it looks like. Well, that's a pretty big improvement. So here we have a title. We have a subtitle. We have, you know, breaks capitalized. We have wool capitalized. Now, notice that, you know, you can use this little addition here, not just to box plot, but to any plot that, you know, you can create with the ggplots um, within R. 